Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here again today with Juke. Who is here? Ain't you, buddy? Ah! This is very unprofessional. I love you too, though. Today, we have some very, very, very exciting news. Because today, we have a sponsored video. A sponsored video. Links for all sponsors will be down below. And uh, so yeah, although this is a sponsored video, if you're interested in DaVinci Resolve, I will still keep watching because we're going to be talking about some very cool stuff. So yeah, obviously we're going to talk about transitions and uh, different things like light leaks and all that and basically things that are in the uh, pack down below which you can purchase. And to be honest, the things in the pack are things that are really important which you as video editors and filmmakers should definitely get because uh, it's things I myself use all the time. The assets are fantastic because, you know, there, there's things there that you, that you could spend ages since looking for that I've used before in the past and spent ages searching for, like VHS glitches and things like that. There's also uh, a, a lot, a lot of transitions. I mean, a lot of transitions. Now, transitions are super, super important now. I'd say there's about two years worth of videos on my channel that, um, are set to private and the reason is because for the first two years of making YouTube videos my transition work was absolutely awful and it's pretty embarrassing to look back at the videos. One of the main things that makes a good YouTuber stand out from a really bad one is the transition work. Down below you can find a link for a one-time purchase of the pack which is the transition library. However, if you frequently need access to unlimited stock videos, music, sound effects, other video templates and resources, you may want to consider this subscription, which is down below too. This second link is a very, very helpful for content creators. You can buy a subscription license and get access to millions of creative assets from graphic to videos, to web templates, music tracks, stock photos, from $16.50 a month. How much is that in pounds? How much is $16.50 in pounds? Oh. Really? It's a bargain, buddy. That's an absolute bargain. Well. Okay, so let's have a quick look then. So, uh, $35 for a regular license. 1,500 plus all-in-one transitions, titles, sound effects, callouts, and lots. Okay, so you, you probably saw that I used one of these little callouts here uh, earlier in the video when I put in the price, and uh, yeah, that's really cool as well. Like, uh, way better than the titles that you get for DaVinci Resolve. So that's that's nice. Optimized for M1 works with DaVinci Resolve 16, 17, 17 point one. Uh, a thousand transitions, that's mental! That is such a bargain. Okay, so this is obviously very cool as well, the target zoom, where you kind of target in and zoom in. That's that's pretty sweet. I like that a lot. Different categories, you get your zoom transitions, which are pretty sweet. Roll transitions, split transitions, spin transitions, glitch, fades and stuff. Yep, warp, objects. Oh, so this is cool actually, yeah, I did not expect this when I seen it. But that's pretty cool, you get the uh, cars and planes flying past and stuff, so that's pretty good. To the makers of these transitions though, what I would like is my dog running past the screen. Now, that would be very cool. I'll send you a photo of him. Okay, sound effects include camera swooshes, zoom swooshes, glitch data, glitch analog sound, split scribble, stretch boop, elastic boop. So you get, so for this price, you get the transition package, online support, which is very handy. Detailed video tutorials, yep, future updates, customization service, and new free presets every month. That's amazing. New free presets every month for that price. So yeah, I'm just gonna go over a few of the templates that are my favorites. So let's jump into DaVinci Resolve. Ugh. Okay, so let's have a quick look at LUTs to begin with, shall we? So we'll go to color here. Now we go to LUTs. We have many, many LUTs. Okay, so uh there's loads of lots which are very cool. I quite like these vintage lots, they're personal favourites of mine. I'm also a big fan of their Hollywood lots. So you can see here we got these uh, very nice lots. Yeah. These ones make me a bit jaundice. 
I'm gonna go with the vintage because they're old and so am I. So let's say for example I want to use this very vintage looking lot. I would drag it onto my clip, go to the end here, highlight, and then if I go back to the start and I push the middle mouse button, all of my clips have now became very vintage. Now what I like to do is, just keep it simple, is uh, if you see down here you got your temperature, your tint and your hue and your contrast and all that, right? I tend to, if I want to adjust them a little bit, I'll just go down here and I click on the little number here and then I drag it to make the changes that I want to make. And then once it looks exactly how I want it, then I leave it at that. And also if you want you can lift the shadows here as well, which is very, very handy. Look at that. Excellent. So lots, loads of cool lots. Right. And uh, now what we're going to do is we go to the edit tab, right? And then we're going to go to effects library. Yeah. And then you can see here we got our very fancy title. Nitros. Nitros me. The callouts are very cool. So that's something that I'm going to start using quite a lot. I think actually when I'm pretending the juke's talking and stuff, this is, this is ideal. Oh wait, did I say pretending? Juke talks. Juke talks. A very simple case of taking your title and just dragging and dropping it on here. Put it here. And then you can basically go into this section up here and change what is written on the screen. So I'll say potato. Yeah. Potato. And then I'll scroll down to the next box here. Potato head. Very cool. Now, you can actually, you can, you can make adjustments here as well, which is very cool. So, you can change the type of font that you're using. You can change the color. So right now I've got white text, but if I want to, I can make it green. Very nice. And I can change the size. So it's a huge, giant potato. And yeah, there's a lot of many, many things. You can change the background color here as well. So I quite like green. So I'm going to go green. And there we go. Look at that. Very nice. So yeah, I can see me using this screen here with text on top of it for quite a few things. When you want to uh, adjust how long the text is on your screen for, you just click the edge here, pull it out or pull it in to get the desired effect of how long you want it to be there for. Very simple stuff. Okay, so next, next we have transitions. Right, okay, so it's very weird. So I'm actually editing the start part of this video. I could have paused it up there. Yeah, look at my weird face. Okay. So the transitions are, oh my God, the transitions are incredible. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, video transitions, okay. And then I'll come down here to my little transitions that go here. So let's see. Color delay down, very nice. Light rays arc left, that's cool. I like that. Light rays, very, very nice. Very nice. Damn ghost. Oh, look at my head. Okay, nice. Damn glow. Beautiful. Oh, these are really cool. Really cool. Now, oh, damn warp. Right ghost. Nice. Nice. Right lens. Oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful. Roll. Oh, that's cool. Quite like this light rays arc left transition. That's very cool. Let's have a look at this. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here again today with Juke. That's cool. Okay, and what else we got? So yeah, a, a roll is always good. A roll transition. I'm going to use these quite a bit, I reckon. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Nice one. Yeah, we've got some really cool uh, transitions here. That's sweet. So, would I pay for this? Honest, honest answer. Would I pay money for this? Um, yeah, I definitely would. I mean, it's things like this that'll bring your video editing up to the next level. So I would definitely, definitely pay for this. And the good thing as well is, it works with the paid version of DaVinci Resolve. Also the free version as well. So you can actually still save a fortune by using the free version, which is, just, quite frankly, still amazing. And you spend a little money to beef up a little bit with this bundle. And then, yeah, you're laughing all the way to the pie shop. Jake, we need an outro song for this video. Jukey's bum's a drum. Jukey's bum's a drum. Jukey's bum's a drum. Jukey's bum's a drum.